Hi, I'm Travis Zimmerman. This is a Daily Pulse from Speak My Word Ministries, and we're going back to the book of Exodus. And as the Israelites are wandering around in the desert, one of the things that God instructs them in is, is the specific way that he would like the temple, the place where they will worship, and the dimensions and exactly what will go where and how to construct it. It's fascinating. And at the very end of the culmination of it is, is this verse. It's from Exodus chapter 40, verse 34 to 35. The glory of the Lord. And they had just finished constructing it. Then the cloud covered the tent of meeting, and the glory of the Lord filled the tabernacle. Moses could not enter the tent of meeting because the cloud had settled upon it, and the glory of the Lord filled the tabernacle. So here is our infinite God. You were seeing an infinite, our infinite God, and we have a very finite temple that's built in the wilderness. So it's fairly large, but it's, it's not <laughs> anywhere near God, but yet... God comes in tabernacles. God comes and lives in this temple, you know, and resides in his temple. And the analogy I kept, whenever I read this, I keep thinking about is if we were to sleep in a dollhouse, you know, we're, we're, we're big humans. And my daughter, my dad made my, my dad and my mom made our daughter a dollhouse several years ago. And it, it was pretty big, but, you know, it was for doll babies. And can you imagine us sleeping in that thing? You know, we're not going to sleep too well in, in the beds they make. The beds are about this big. And here is God coming down and, and you know, residing, tabernacling in the, the, in the temple. And I think that's a cute picture because, I mean, again, it's, it's very holy and it don't make any light of it at all. But yet God dwells among men and Jesus with us. That kind, of, that, that kind of imagery in the Old Testament about God living with us, Jesus with us, God is with us, Emmanuel. There's so many connections in the Old Testament to Jesus Christ. And again, I wanted to share this fascinating with, with you today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.